many other teenagers, pretty obsessed with social media. I spent a lot of time scrolling through Instagram or sending my friends snaps on my day. I mean, I practically use it every day. Social media is a great tool for communication during those holidays with your friends, family, or that guy who slid into your DMs, or to show off that tropical vacation spot you visited. All jokes aside, however many followers you have, there's always the hope of getting the amount of likes you wish, and to get supportive comments. If we don't get enough likes or wonderful comments, you sometimes feel like you have to delete the post. You know, we always hear from these professors or older people, social media is really bad, blah blah blah, bad mental health, depression. As a fellow teenager, I'm here to tell you that they are not completely wrong. What if I told you that Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and Snapchat are not good for you will think? Hi guys, my name is Nofasia, I'm from MC1101A, so today I'm going to talk about the negative impact of social media. However, social media, which can be really beneficial, can also be harmful. And in this video, we're going to go through some of the negative effects of social media. Social media can make some people have unrealistic expectations or a negative body image. You could scroll through many different social media sites and find a sea of beautiful people with perfect bodies. Walk into any public place and you'll see a more realistic version of what society really looks like. Not everyone is drop dead gorgeous with a perfectly toned body. The truth is that on social media, you are only seeing the absolute best physical version of people. Many times it took 64 photos or an hour of touch up on a photo editing software program to produce that immaculate version of them. Next time you're scrolling through the sea of beautiful people, keep in mind that just because someone looks in great shape in a photo doesn't mean they're healthy or happy. Many of you won't believe me or many of you will deny because you know it's true. There are many negative effects from this app that have you found its way into your life whether you have noticed or not. This app appears to be fun, convenient and interactive ways to talk with friends or catch up with the latest trends. But they are not harmless as they may seem. As a result of social media, you may think that it can have a bad effect into your life or the life of those around you. After listening to what I have to say today, I will give you a new perspective on social media and the hard control that it can have people's life. People feel too comfortable on the web and say things that will normally in real life. So if you're not going to say the horrible things, you're still inevitably going to be exposed to it. Which one is of many negative effects of social media? Cyberbullying, whether it's directed at you or not, will lead to more negative talk and likely more negative perspective of humanity a world. Social media have a lot of power of dangers and even people doesn't even notice. Our life become more complicated because social media is very useful tool for us in 21 century. It could help us to improve our life. parents should pay more attention on controlling children's device on social media according to their age, especially for teenagers. With so many platforms of social media giving more harm than good for instance cyberbullying, addiction and mental health problems, for example stress, depression and low self-esteem.
that's all about informative of negative impact of social media thank you guys bye bye